Hi, this is Josh. I'm a pharmacist with PharmacistTips.com. Here to discuss the common uh, over-the-counter medication, loperamide. We'll discuss the uses, the dosage, as well as some side effects that can occur. Topics that will be covered in this video include what it is, what loperamide is, how it works in the body, what we use it for, the side effects, and other ways uh, the diarrhea can be managed. So what is loperamide? It is an anti-diarrheal medication, very commonly known in the U.S. as Imodium AD. Sometimes you'll see it combined with Cymethicone. Cymethicone can help manage some gas symptoms that can occur with diarrhea. Uh, many times you will see store brand products as well, many generics simply labeled anti-diarrheal. But if you look at the package, the uh, active ingredient should be loperamide. How does it work in the body? It works by slowing down the muscles in the intestines. It helps increase the transit time, the longer time that food and liquid is in the digestive tract, and it helps reduce the loss of fluid and electrolytes. What is it used for? Diarrhea. Diarrhea is the use, the primary use for loperamide. Usual dosage for over-the-counter, of course, you're going to want to look at the package and make sure you follow the package instructions, but typically it's uh, four milligrams or two tablets initially, and then one tablet after each loose stool, not to exceed eight milligrams per day. Prescription, it can be used up to 16 milligrams per day. However, to, you're, the dose is generally reduced as you're on it to help control symptoms, usually down into the four to eight milligram per day. It will, of course, depend on the, the cause and uh, whether it's controlling it properly, and your healthcare provider can determine the appropriate dose for you. What about side effects for loperamide? Typically, they are generally mild, uh, especially if you take it at the proper dosage. Dizziness, stomach cramps, nausea can occur. Those, of course, uh, could also be due to the diarrhea. Constipation can occur if we take a more a higher dose than needed or if we take it longer than we need. So mornings to keep in mind, loperamide is safe medication when taken at appropriate dosing. But however, when exceeding that regular dosing, it can be fatal. Heart attack and death can occur. Um, unfortunately, some folks will take a large amount. Um, that's why package sizes have been reduced in the U.S. So people uh, cannot buy a large amount of the medication at a time. Other considerations, um, if your symptoms do not improve within a few days or if your symptoms worsen, you'd certainly want to follow up with a healthcare provider to determine if other treatment would be required. Uh, also, eating and drinking, we want to continue to, uh, once we're feeling up to it, we want to eat and drink. We want to replenish the fluids and electrolytes that have been lost due to diarrhea. And they often recommend what's called the BRAT diet. That's just bland food, bananas, rice, apples, toast, um, things, clear soups, anything that um, won't irritate the digestive tract too much, but can help give you energy. We want to avoid coffee simply because coffee can be uh, slightly irritating to the lining of the digestive tract and dairy products as well. The enzymes our body uses to properly digest dairy products can be flushed away when we have a, a bout of diarrhea. So it takes a few days for those to replenish. Uh, Appreciate you watching. Remember, this is not medical advice, informational purposes only. And I would appreciate it if you liked the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.